Hey everybody, what's going on? Randomness for the Windman here, and we are Bach. We are Bach with The Walking Dead season two, episode two. The episode just came out today. It is March fifth. Now you may be saying, but it came out the fourth. It came out the fourth for PS3 and PC, which is why you see people like PewDiePie and Vash have it up. So I'm w I. I waited to get the today to play it myself before uh, doing that. Um, it came out on Xbox today, and it comes out on iOS tomorrow, the 6th. So, uh, I hope to have this episode up the 6th, uh, which is why I'm recording it around noon. So I can get it done, get to uh, Sony Vegas, make the master copy, make the first episode and bam so we're gonna jump right into it but first of all I just noticed this because I actually uh, have like earbuds in so like I'm playing on with an HDMI cable but I could use my the uh, uh, headset uh, listener thing the connector whatever because I'm able to, uh, I was able to plug in my AV cables and my HDMI cables at the same time. And I'm just realizing now, this music sounds like The Last of Us. Like, it, it's distinct. It sounds very distinct. Anyway, let's just, let's, let's just go. Let's just go. Let's have some fun. A house divided. Let's go. It's still better be Kenny. And all of those people who have played the episode and you're like, Oh, it's Kenny. Or, Oh, it's not Kenny. I'm like, Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. I want it to be Kenny. He's my favorite of the original. I've got Gatorade to drink because we're out of everything else. It's freezing. Wait till we get up to Wellington. Then talk to me about coal. I'm gonna go look for more wood. Where's the rest of your crew? I, I'm by myself. Bullshit. Krista, run! Wow, this recap is not like the Wolf Among Us in which it took two minutes. I'm out. Grab her. Let's go. So, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? I don't know. I'm kind of on my own now. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? Who's Carver? You were in the woods with Krista. Please. Ah! <laughs> I'm fine. I'm fine. Just, just lost my footing. Damn it. God damn it. Come this way. Damn it, you get your asses over here, both of you! See, everyone that I watch who played this game already, like the two, three people I watch who played it, they all went and saved to go save Nick. I'm like, out of all the people I know, I think I'm the only one who chose him.
Which I think was the right choice, because, like, Nick had ammo. And... No, not Carver. Carver's the... Whatever. This guy we're with... Was, uh... The one who needed it. Downside, we can't get through them. What are you looking at? What do you think I'm looking at? Staring ain't polite. How are you feeling? Well, other than this bite, I'm just peachy. Oh, don't be all pissy at me. This is some saw shit. Are you sure? I got nothing to lose. Other than the Piggly Wigglies, of course. He won't do it. Stuck pig. What are you gonna do? Carry me out of here on your back? Hell. It's just. Just give me a minute. I don't think he'd be able to do it himself anyway, like. There's a lot of stuff in here. I'll, I'll continue when uh she's done talking. But it's like. I heard. I read somewhere that. Your fingers are so um, uh, weak that someone can literally bite them off like a carrot. But you can't do it because it's part of your body. So, like, you'd feel the pain and instantly stop. But somebody with the full force would be able to bite it off like a carrot. So... It's kind of like that. He wouldn't be able to cut his own leg off. Because it's part of his own body and... He, uh... The pain would make him stop instantly. So, I think it's something like that. But I'm not, uh... Not too sure. Well, fuck. <laughs> I really, really hope <clears throat> we can, uh, give me one of those. Probably tastes like pine tar by now, but I'd smoke a dead coon's tail if you had one. Hand it here. Eh, I'll just give it to him. He's bitten, he's got really, like, nothing much to lose. about as bad as it smells now what we wait I really hope it's Kenny I really hope it's Kenny that's like the only part of this episode of this episode of The Walking Dead that I really want <clears throat> is for it to be Kenny. Oh, his name is Pete. Okay, he's not dead. It's just setting in. Oh, damn it. I feel like ten pounds 
lots of shit in the five pound sack. <laughs> you and your analogies, Pete. You good old Pete. What has he got to do with it? Again, the whole damn day. You want to hear something funny? You don't sound like funny. I don't want to die. <laughs> oh, he's looking so much like Lee. The eyes are yellow and. Uh. I never thought I'd be the kind of idiot to say something like that. But there it is. I'm scared, Clementine. Jesus, I'm scared. What does it feel like? Uh, it feels like... Like a rope was wrapped around my neck. I'm getting tighter every second. It feels like I can't... <laughs> Would you would you promise me you'll watch out for Nick? I love that stupid kid. No matter what you think, he is a good boy. I'll do what I can. Thank you. Been almost a day. They ain't gonna find us. <clears throat> he looks Gonna have to make a break for it. I'll buy you some time. You're coming with me. To do what? Die a couple hours later than now? To say goodbye to Nick. All right. I'll try. Well, like my daddy used to say, <clears throat> we're burning daylight. Lee said that too. Ah, this episode is just one big, huge thing. Like, oh, hey, it's Lee all over again, Clementine. In the darkness, he kind of actually looks like him too. God damn it, why is, like, every episode so hard in the feels in the first 15 minutes? Episode 1, oh, me dies, and then, like, 10 minutes later, we get separated from Krista. Hey, I don't care if it's a new morning or anything. It's bullshit. Is my battery almost half dead? No, it says it's full. But the light was... Oh, whatever. Look, we didn't even get the episode title till just now. I'm sick of it. I love it, but I'm sick of it. <laughs> hey guys, guess what? I'm back. Clementine, are you all right? I'm fine. Luke's not with you. Where's Alvin? What happened? It's been hours. Where are they? Pete got bit. What? What happened? Walkers. My God. Where were you? Where were you exactly? Down by the stream. We gotta go. Just hold on a minute. My husband is still out there. Get the guns. Luke and Alvin went out looking for you. I told them not to go. Damn it, Luke. Can I get a gun? Can you, can you please watch Sarah? Oh. She's upstairs. Just distract her. I'll take care of her. You can trust me. Thank you. Okay. You'll be safe inside. Just don't open the doors for anything. We'll be back soon. And thank you. All right. I thought I was going to go with and help look, but whatever. I guess we're going to have some bonding time with Sarah. <sighs> okay. Say cheese. Pinocchio. I found this under the house. There was all kinds of old stuff. So cool. 
Take one of me. Come on, take one of me. Sure. Get me in a good pose, okay? Okay, I'm ready. <laughs> What's wrong? Um, where's my dad? Uh, um, you're scaring me. He'll be fine. He'll be fine. Are you sure? Yes, he'll be fine. Yeah, Clementine, don't look. God damn it. Sorry, I, I, I just need to. Okay. Fetal position. Okay, well, she got up and sit down right away. No. No. What if I have to use one? No. Everything is dangerous. I need to know sometime. You should let your dad teach you. What should I shoot? Don't do that. Sorry. Sorry. Maybe I could practice outside. No. Hey, Luke's back. What? Wait. No. Sarah, don't do that. I don't think that's Luke. I, Clementi, put some haste in. Oh, wait, I forgot. Hold on. Hold on. What's the, uh. I forgot. I can run. Totally forgot I could do that. It's not Luke. If you guys remember the uh, the uh, next time on the Walking Dead thing, Clementine. That's not Luke. Clementine said there was a guy here looking for you. Is she asthmatic? Hello. Hello there. Hello. How are you? Okay. How are you? Well, I'm doing just fine. Thank you. My family and I are set up a ways down river. I'm kind of surprised we haven't run into each other yet. What's your name? Oh. <sighs> What's your name? <laughs> My name is George, honey. Pleasure to meet you. You mind if I come in for a bit? Would you please leave? This is a nice place. Is there anyone else around? You don't usually see cabins this big out here. Just me and, and dad. Yeah? What's his name? Uh, I'm gonna have to say... Strong oh. I, like him already. I thought I was gonna have to choose. I would have said Lee. Out. Well, I'll cut to the chase. I'm out looking for my people. Seven of them, to be exact. They've been gone a long while, and I'm worried they might have gotten lost. Maybe you've seen them. A couple of farm boys and an old man. Spanish guy and his daughter. Quiet girl. A bit taller than you. Big black guy. This big. I haven't seen him. Well, that's a shame. You sure? Pretty sure. He doesn't like our answers. Two people. Looks like a tornado ran through here. 
Yeah, well, I'm supposed to be doing the dishes. Just passing through, or you've been here a while? A while. Listen, kid, I hope you're not one of those nuts headed up north looking for Shangri-La. And I'm not sure why you'd go anywhere after finding this place. Just passing through, going north. Whole lot of people headed that way lately. Me, I don't get it. There's just as much nothing up there as there is down here. And I can't stand that Yankee weather. The cold slows them down. Well, that's not worth the trade, in my opinion. Oh, it is.